Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're a first time watcher, glad to have you here. If you're a returning favorite, welcome back. So today, tonight, whatever it is, I have a quick uh, video on the Kringle Candle Easter fragrances. There are only three released this year. Uh, one is already sold out and the other two are very close to selling out. Um, I think there's only like less than 50 of both of them. And I'm recording this at 7.10 on Thursday evening. Because I want to get this out um, in case you guys were kind of on the edge about if you wanted one of the two remaining ones. And uh, so this is going to be real, real quick because um, I haven't burned them yet. And obviously I'm not going to have time to do a burn review on these with as little as there are remaining, right? So uh, we'll go over them real quick here. This is the uh, Marshmallow Chicks one. Um, this is the one that sold out. This sold out in less than a day. It was went live at 9 a.m. and I think by 6 o'clock it was sold out. Uh, one thing to note, they do have these gold lids. They're not silver, they're gold. I'm not a gold fan myself. Um, so, whatever. Um, <laughs> I, the silver hammered ones would have been nice, but... Or just silver. But uh, I'm not a gold fan. Uh, then we have chocolate bunnies here. With this wrap around. Very nice. And last but not least, we have Jelly Beans. This is probably my favorite label. Um, I just love that pattern in there. So let's talk about Jelly Beans. So Jelly Beans and Chocolate Bunnies are the two that are still in stock. I'll talk about those first. So you can if you choose to buy them and end the video and go pick them up, whatever you want to do. Um, this one shocked me. So Jelly Beans, right? Um, blood Orange, Pomegranate, Cassis, Bergamot, Acai Berry, and Orange. This is not the same jelly beans that Kringle released in like 2018 or 2019 um, in their initial three, which it was a purple wax, right? There was the grass one, which is amazing. Um, there was the Easter lily one. There was a blue one. So it was purple, pink, blue, green, and yellow. There were like five of them. So this is not Kringle's first foray into Easter. Um, but, so again, three wicks, 100% soy wax. This one, <laughs> very citrusy, right? It's, it's orange. It's a, a nice juicy orange. Um, the blood orange is in here, the pomegranate. Um, not really picking up the bergamot, but is, this is like a nice, fresh, juicy orange fragrance I'm getting here. Um, and that's obviously on cold, right? Haven't burned these yet, but I'm liking it. Um, I only ordered one of these cause I didn't think I was going to like it. Cause it was jelly bean. It has jelly bean in the name. I typically don't like it. Um, Yankees is pretty bad. <laughs> but yeah. If you want a fruity, citrusy, juicy, uh, fragrance, this is pretty nice. Um, I kind of like it better than Sicilian Orange. It's not my favorite. So, but I do love the pattern on this. Next we'll go with Chocolate Bunnies. Chocolate Bunnies, right there. This is nice. Again, I only ordered one, because chocolate's not my thing, um, but I ordered it to review and um, have in my collection. Uh, also, if you want to use, uh, say, 15% use code uh, Philly Candleman, link will be in the description below and the code, all that stuff. Um, save you 15% on these. So this is very nice uh, chocolate fragrance, sort of like, uh, like a Cadbury egg, right? Um, chocolate, cream, caramel, vanilla, and coconut. It's definitely a milk chocolate. Um, almost like a powdery milk chocolate. Uh, sort of like... Sort of like a, like a hot cocoa powdery chocolate, um, but you get that cream in there, which makes me think, you know, uh, Cadbury egg, and there's a little bit of the caramel. The coconut, the coconut doesn't really come out on cold, <clears throat> but the cream and the caramel, that does for sure. So again, if you're looking for a chocolate fragrance that's not too heavy, this is a lot lighter than the triple chocolate in the reserve. Um, this is like a fluffy, um, milk chocolate, right? It's not heavy. It's not super decadent. 
but it's just a nice light chocolate. And it's cute. Cute labels there too with the bunnies. Next year, I'll put this out there publicly. Next year, um, I like to see some labels with remember in the 90s, um, all of our moms had it, I think, in their kitchen where the uh the geese with the they were carrying the baskets, they had the blue ribbon, the blue or the white bonnet, the blue ribbons, right? Uh my kitchen was decked out in that wallpaper and um the glasses. We had it all. We had it all. And there was like a a, a blue uh, on the glass. There was a, a, a blue line across and then the geese or the, I don't know if they were geese or swans or whatever they were. They were they were white. Um, maybe they were ducks or I don't know, swans. I, mean, I don't know. But if you remember that pattern, that's what I would like to see. Some nice retro 90s uh, packaging. Um, and then we go to this loud packaging, right? Uh, this is the Marshmallow Chicks. This is the one that sold out. Um, like right away, I ordered four of them because it's a lemon marshmallow fragrance. I think that's why a lot of folks um, gravitate toward it because, you know, like Bath & Body Works has lavender marshmallow. So now we have a lemon marshmallow. <clears throat> but it has a few other things in here. So it's just not a lemon marshmallow. Marshmallow, smooth vanilla, lemon, sugar crystals, and creamy butter. <clears throat> so with the... With this, you get the lemon in here, you get the marshmallow. Um, I kind of would have liked it if they left it more simple than adding in that, that butter, the creamy butter. Um, I don't think it was needed. Unless they just wanted to tone it down a little bit because, you know, lemon will take over a fragrance if it's not toned down correctly. But yeah, so this comes back next year and you like lemon marshmallow. I'll be burning this and I'll post update, but... As of now, I don't think they're coming back. Um, Kringle's production is already um, stacked or uh, scheduled through August. So I don't think there's time to produce this in less than a month for uh, for Easter there. But let me know, did you pick any of these up? Did you get this one? What are your thoughts? Are you, what are you excited for? Yeah, lemon marshmallow. Could do without the butter, but We'll give it a go. Again, this one sold out. Jelly beans and um, chocolate bunnies are still available. You can use code uh, Philly Candleman to save 15% off your purchase. And uh, and there's more. More exciting stuff to come. Um, they just released the wax melts and the daylights today for the new spring and summer lineup. Uh, oh, there's also a deal going on right now. If you didn't pick up any of the spring sense in either the country or the um kringle candle line they're doing a 12 pack of daylights for only 24 bucks so you can sample every single scent which is great uh, it's only two dollars a wax melt they're normally four dollars each so if you just wanted to uh, sample that you can and then decide what you want from there so all right guys that's what i have for today thank you very much and stay safe out there have a good one